Yeah, the other thing that I have noticed as well, and this this isn't for every business owner, obviously, but just kind of like a trend, mm -hmm. a general trend, is that it seems like a lot of business owners in a way want to be hands off in their business. So they want to be already like 10 years down the road, but they're mm. not. Yeah. And so like in order to get to a place where you can be more hands off and in a more supervisory role, like you need to have the operations and the foundations in place to get there. And True. so the when structure, right? Yeah. And so when you're <clears throat> building your business, like you do have to be hands on and you have to be like the director and the leader and the guide and the vision. Yeah. And you like with that comes hard conversations, confrontation, and like my experience with the Kenyan population in general is that Kenyans are tend to be more avoidant than confrontational. Like mm. when it comes to interpersonal relations. Or when there's something wrong. We tend to like I've noticed a trend of avoidance, not of like confronting. Oh yeah, yeah. And so mm -hmm. even being able to have like the understanding of like, how do you confront your employee yeah. and like give con constructive criticism and fire them if you need to, because like employees will sink your business if you don't. That's very true. And so it's like all of these things go into having a healthy business. And so we want to just use as many facets as possible. You know, like with our product Kuza, you can have clear like oversight into your operations. When you tune into our socials, you can start to get like more of an educational aspect around business. And it's mm. super localized to the context here. Yeah. Because I've been working with small businesses here since 2017. Yeah. And, and like very, in very hands-on ways. So I'm aware. And even to, to, to touch on <laughs> that, 